Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if temporary files are not deleting on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So when you do a lot of tasks on your Windows computer, Windows will create temporary files that can range in kilobytes to megabytes, to even gigabytes or terabytes in size and even some very extreme cases. Most of you guys probably won't be dealing in units that large you know, for temporary files, but, you know, definitely there could be several gigabytes worth of temporary files being stored on your computer in some cases. So in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about some troubleshooting methods on how to go ahead and delete those temporary files. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is start by opening up the search menu, type in percent sign app data, and then another percent sign. And then go ahead and open up that file folder that should appear in that list. And then at this point, you go ahead and just highlight over whatever folders or files are in this file directory. Right click and then select the trash can icon or you can select delete on your keyboard. And then select do this for current items and then select continue. Some temporary files might not be able to be deleted in here, so it's certainly possible that you might not be able to delete all of them. However, most of them should be able to be deleted successfully in here. Again, that would be underneath temporary internet files. So once you've done that, you can go ahead and just click on the this PC option on the left side. Double click on local disk where Windows is installed, and then double click on the Windows folder, and then go down to the software distribution folder and double click on it should be a download folder, double click on that as well. And then again, you can highlight over all these folders or tap Control and A on your keyboard at the same time. This is basically going to go ahead and delete or clear out your Windows Update cache. So we're gonna go ahead and right click once we've highlighted these folders and then select the Delete icon. Or again, you can select the Delete key on your keyboard if you choose to do so. And then once you're done with that, you go ahead and close out of here. And if you want to set Windows to automatically delete temporary files after a certain time interval, you can select that. So just going forward, it will clear them out. In order to do that, just open up the search menu, type in settings. Best result should come back with settings listed right above app. Go ahead and left click on that. And then on the left side, select system. And then on the right side, you want to scroll down and select storage. And then locate where it says Storage Sense, and go ahead and left click on that. And where it says Configure Cleanup Schedules, Fund Storage Sense, click the drop down here, and you can select every day, week, or month, which will delete other temporary files as well. But this is primarily cleaning up temporary system and app files, so the settings down here pretty much are going to achieve what we're looking for, as well as doing some periodic maintenance on our computer, which certainly is not a bad thing for most of you guys. So, pretty straightforward process in here, guys. You can just go ahead and configure some of those settings. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.